हेलो स्टूडेंट माय सेल्फ मोहम्मद इम्तियाज़ अंसारी असिस्टेंट प्रोफेसर शोमास स्कूल ऑफ मेडिकल एंड एलाइड साइंसेज जी डी गोयनका यूनिवर्सिटी गुरुग्राम हरियाणा टूडे आवर टॉपिक इज रेडियोग्राफिक टर्मिनोलॉजी लर्निंग ऑब्जेक्टिव्स टू अंडरस्टैंड द एनाटोमिकल टर्मिनोलॉजी टू अंडरस्टैंड द पोजिशनिंग टर्मिनोलॉजी to understand the rotational terminology first of all we need to study some about anatomy and physiology anatomy the study of a structure and the relationships among structures or organs physiology the study of how body structures function or ya how body organ functions anatomical position body is erect with the feet parallel and the arm hanging at the side with the palms facing forward anterior and posterior position anterior to be situated near or towards the front of the body <coughs> anterior means forward posterior to be situated towards the back of the body posterior means backward superior and inferior superior means to be situated towards the upper part or head of the body positioned above another organ or structure inferior to be situated towards the lower part of the body or positioned below another organ or structure next cranial and caudal cranial means refers to the head end and caudal means refers to the tail end medial and lateral medial to be closer to the midline of the body or a structure being internal as opposed to stuck external lateral lateral to be further away in the direction of either side from the midline of the body or a structure proximal and distal proximal towards or nearest to the trunk or the point of origin of a part or organ distal away from or farthest from the trunk or the point of origin of a part you can see in this picture uh, superior inferior anterior anterior also ventral and posterior uh, also dorsal distal proximal next unilateral bilateral unilateral means one side bilateral means on both side superficial and deep superficial near the outer surface of the body skin is superficial to the muscle layer deep farthest away farther away from the surface of the body that is muscular layer is deep to the skin but superficial to the intestine intermediate between superficial and deep structures that is the navel is intermediate to the uh, the left arm and the contralateral right leg body plans these are based on four imaginary planes that pass through the body in the anatomical position they are sagittal coronal and transverse plane sagittal plane it divides body into right and left halves or your parts mid sagittal plane it divides body into two equal halves coronal plane it divides body into anterior and posterior part transverse plane or your 
एक्सियल प्लेन और यह क्रॉस सेक्शनल हॉरिजेंटल सेक्शन इट डिवाइड्स इनटू अपर एंड लोअर पार्ट्स इन दिस पिक्चर यू कैन सी द मूवमेंट ऑफ बॉडी पार्ट्स फ्लेक्शन एक्सटेंशन of uh, elbow joint and flexion and extension of knee joint in this picture you can see the flexion and extension of wrist joint and uh, flexion and extension of ankle joint dorsiflexion and plantar flexion another movement adduction and abduction abduction means moving a part moving a body part away from midline adduction means moving a body part towards the midline supination and pronation supination rotating hand or forearm laterally and pronation rotating hand or forearm medially plantar flexion or dorsi flexion plantar flexion point toes of foot downward stand on tip toes dorsi flexion point toes foot upward foot of the gas pedal inversion or eversion inversion movement of sole of foot inward or movement of sole of foot outward medial and lateral medial means internal rotation anterior surface move towards midline lateral means external rotation anterior surface move away from the midline protection and retraction protection moving forward on plane parallel to ground punch retraction moving backward on plane parallel to ground circumduction circumduction means a round it is the combination of flexion extension abduction and adduction thank you